I swear I will. Fuck you and your queen. That's enough. So long as you're in my camp, you will obey my orders. And getting pissed drunk before a mission. Obey? You know what kind of ship brain fool does that? One who wants to fucking die out there. Have you lost your damn mind? I am not some animal in a cage. Well, in the seven bloody hells. What's going on? Why the hell are you drinking? Since when do I need a fucking reason? She can't fight like this, Asher. You think I'm too drunk to fight? What the fuck what do you What are you, you gonna know? do? Run out there swinging a fucking... Ah! Ooh. Still think I can't fight? You fucking bitch! Oh, there we go. There's the asshole I remember. Hey, come on, Beska. Leave the poor Let man alone. Let me before I break your fingers. Deal with your friend! She'll get us all you killed. Yes, I've heard that. I'm not sure. This is bloody important. <laughs> you afraid your mother will spank you? I will not let you two fuck this up. Are you up. looking forward to it? Mind your own business, Croft. You don't need to worry about us. Just take care of this, because if she can't hold it together, we're leaving without the both of you. <laughs> you think your little thumbcock can take Marine all by itself? <sighs> I'd never work with a bloody show like you Best anyway. What the hell is going on? <sighs> you gonna lecture me too? <gasps> oh shit! I watched oh. dubs. Croft doesn't know shit about anything. None of you do. Fuck Croft. You think I give two shits about what Croft has to say? <sighs> oh. That was just English. Your nicht. fucking uncle is the only reason I'm even here. He told your little dragon queen I would go into marine with you. You brought me here. Just talk to me, Beska. We're done talking. Die hat irgendwie Angst davor. Gefällt dir jedenfalls nicht, dass. Alter, was ist das für ein Amazone? Oh, this was a real fight. He'd be dead. Is this what you want? <lacht> oh, was, wozu das jetzt bringt? Ich weiß es nicht. Ich weiß es nicht, Leute. Ganz ruhig, ey. Ich Problem ist mit Marine, you have to get over it. Get over it. I was a slave. Oh. Yeah. In this fucking city. I was taken from my home when I was only three years old. When I was seven, my master threw me in the fighting pits to die. When my master tired of watching me kill animals for sport, he started. He started sending other children. Doha. Das hart. Das ist verdammt harte. Every one of them. Boah. I after a while I thought the fear was gone. But it made you strong, didn't it? You say that like it makes it worth it. There was this boy. We used to play five stones in the alley when we couldn't sleep. When I saw him next, he was in that pit with me. Das ist unfassbar hart, ey. I saw the fear in his eyes. That same fear I felt my first time. And I realized it hadn't left me. I still wanted to live. I wanted it so badly. My master watched as I did it. Smiling. That's enough drinking for tonight. It'll only make you feel worse. I don't need any more men telling me what to do. I bought my freedom a long time ago, but I have always hated this place. Hated him. Dezor Zoraza. Because of that man. Sie kann sich doch rächen, falls er noch da ist. Marine is a city of dead children. Don't worry about me. I won't let you down. Come on. You've had enough. Let me say that. <laughs> I 
Ist die schon dicht oder was? Das wäre nicht so gut zum Kämpfen. Das wäre gar nicht gut, Leute. Das wäre nicht gut, wenn die betrunken irgendwie versucht zu kämpfen. Da haben wir nicht so gute Chancen. Weil die ist ja voll das Tier, ey. Die metzelt ja alles nieder. Das haben wir ja schon in den vorigen Folgen oft äh, zu Gesicht bekommen. Lord Whitehill is up to something. He's conspiring against my family. And someone in there is helping him. Lady Marjorie would be furious, Mira. I can't. I'm sorry. I want to help you. But I can't risk it. You said you'd help me. Remember? And I've been trying. But this isn't going to help your situation. Are you sure you want to risk it? I have to. <sighs> All right. Na, da bin ich mal gespannt, Leute. Die schulden sich alle gegenseitig was. Ja. She's with me. We'll stay out of trouble. I promise. It's a bit strange to celebrate, doesn't it? Not so long ago, King Joffrey sat on the Iron Throne. Tommen is our king now. Long may he reign. Sarah! I was worried you'd run off with your friend there. And what if I did? I'm not sure I could blame you. This is Lady Mira Forrester. Mira, Lord Garibald Tarwick. She's quite lovely. Where have you been hiding her? You're making her blush. Sorry, Mira. Hmm. He gets a bit carried away. <laughs> you flatter me. Sarah's lovelier than us all. I won't argue there. It's quite a feast, isn't it? Just be careful around the wine. I hear you're partial to a particular arbor red. It's easy to forget. Nothing you do in King's Landing goes unnoticed. Drink too much once and you're forever the drunken fool. Talk to the wrong people. Oh, and... Lord Tarwick! Der ist, glaube ich, dicht. <lacht> Der will ihn gar nicht beachten. What was that about? Nothing. That subject isn't fit for your delicate ears anyway. <gasps> My ears are not delicate. Of course they are. Look how tiny they are. Little loads. <laughs> What? I mean it. Someone caught your eye, Mira? I'm sorry, I... I um, I'm rather thirsty. Wir schweigen am besten. Oh, allow me. No, I can get it myself. Thank you. If you'll excuse me. This reminds me of the tourney at Lannisport. You wouldn't believe that you told you must jetzt am besten irgendwie belauschen. But you would have loved it. We danced all evening, drank wine from our helmets. That is it! Andros, you're being ridiculous! Da geht's gerade weiter mit der. Wir müssen irgendwie uns da ranschleichen. Komm, wir sprechen erstmal hier mit. Die belauschen wir erstmal die. Why would you ever stop dealing ironwood? Hmm, is there no longer a demand for it? I can't imagine that would be the case. <sighs> no need for such wild speculation. I've simply lost interest. I'm moving on to better things, as they say. This is not so interesting. We go on further. Menschenmenge, da brauchen wir nichts belauschen. 
Wir müssen die zwei hier belauschen. Lord Whitehill trusts me above all others. That's why I'm the only one he's willing to work with. Oh, an exclusive deal. How good for you, Andros. Well, I've got my family to consider. When's the last time you even saw your wife, Andros? Die haben wohl äh, nicht wirklich viel zu sagen. Beziehungsweise die Programmierer haben es einfach <lacht> nicht weiter fortgeführt, die Unterhaltung. Guck mal hier. Trinken wir noch was. Können wir nicht mit dem hier sprechen? Schade, können wir nicht, Leute. Das ist natürlich sehr schade. Hören wir mal zu, was die hier machen. Das ist alles unwichtig, was wir gerade da belauschen. Oh, komm, wir sprechen dann direkt mit denen. Lord Andros? Mira Forrester. Did you come to poke your nose in my business once again? You have a nasty habit of doing that. You're always so livid, Lord Andros. It can't be good for the Constitution. You think you can mock me? You have no idea what you're up against. Why don't you tell me then? You think you and your friend Morgren scare me? Who said Morgren was my friend? Don't play innocent with me. I know what he's planning. You can tell him that either you both stay out of my way, or I'll do much worse than drive him out of business. Good day, Lady Mira. Tue. Ich wusste auch jetzt irgendwie nichts davon, dass der jetzt irgendwie mit uns... Komm, wir sprechen direkt mal mit ihm. <lacht> oh, please, if you'll excuse me. <lacht> Lady Mira, I'm impressed. Impressed with what? That you aren't currently locked in a cell. I trust this means that you took care of that contract. How did you do it, if I may ask? I wasn't expecting to see you again, if I'm being honest. You must have made quick work of it. If I tell you how I did it, what's in it for me? <laughs> Nothing. But I admire the gall. I do believe King's Landing is rubbing off on you. So, what have you been up to? Enjoying yourself? Though I suppose if you're talking to me, you must want something. Oui, oui, oui. When we first met, you were negotiating for Lord Whitehill. That's right. But now Lord Andros seems to think he's the only one working for him. So what happened? It appears that you know most of the story already. I've been pushed out of the ironwood business. Oh. All thanks to my partner. Bloody imbecile. Andros is now Lud Whitehill's exclusive contact in King's Landing. No matter the fact that I introduced them in the first place. That man would be nothing without me. It appears we have an enemy in common, Lord Morgren. I hadn't thought of it that way. Then perhaps you'll have better luck against Andros and his new partner, Lyman Lannister. He's working with a Lannister? A third cousin, to be fair. Whatever Andros is up to, he clearly thinks Lyman can take my place. <laughs> Rickard! Are you done flirting with that handmaiden? We need your opinion here. <lacht> Leave him alone. Please excuse me. Hui, okay, das wird äh, heute eine sehr informative Folge. Wir haben sehr viele Gespräche auf jeden Fall. Jetzt wird wahrscheinlich der nächste, der hier bequatschen, der Herr da hinten sein. Der ist schon wieder zum Saufen gegangen, ne? Mane. Oder? Ja, wir können sogar mit ihm sprechen. Lyman. Um, excuse me. Lyman Lannister? Ah. Hm. Shit. You startled me. 
as if I don't already have enough to deal with. You seem nervous, my lord. I'm not nervous. I just get clumsy sometimes. I'm... I'm afraid you have me at a disadvantage, Lady... Mira. Lady Mira. I'm not used to being approached so boldly. But I'm glad you did. I always feel a bit out of place at the voll am Zittern, eh? So, what brings you over here? I'm not the best company, I'm afraid. Sure, seid ein bisschen ihr arbeitet mit anderen zusammen, richtig? Oh, yeah. Ja. From what I hear, you're in the business of making rather important deals happen. Well, I don't know about that. Come on, don't be modest. I, I really shouldn't talk about it. Andros came to me in confidence. You understand? <laughs> he wouldn't be pleased, I'm sure. If you like. You can whisper it in my ear. I... Well... I suppose I could just... Lyman! What do you think you're doing? What? Nothing. You stay away from him. Andros! We were just talking. You were just talking to Mira Forrester. Forrester? Oh, shit. I, I didn't realize. My lord? Let me say this as plainly as I can. Don't ever meddle in my affairs again. Das war laut. Zu laut. Oh nee, da kommt die Lady Marjorie. Schnell weg hier. Oh nee, die sieht die bestimmt ja jetzt. Lady Marjorie. Schnell weg hier. <lacht> Schnell weg, weg, weg. Lady Mira? That was quite a scene over there. Are you all right? I'm fine. I can handle Lord Andros. It's Lyman I was worried about. What do you mean? Honestly, that story isn't fit for a maiden's ears. Just be careful around him. All right? Just tell me, Lord Tarwick. It's important. I may be willing to tell you. If you'll first tell me something about Sarah. Oh, man. Your help could save me a lot of embarrassment. I'd be very grateful, Lady Mira. What do you want to know about Sarah? Sarah Durwell. Interesting name, that. Funny thing is, the last Durwells died off almost 200 years ago. What can you tell me about her family? We say, we say, we say, we say, You must understand, I can't court a woman just because I like the way she laughs. I've met the Durwells when I was at Highgarden. Oh? They're a small house these days, but very well regarded. Ah, right. Well... That's a relief. For a moment, I thought... And now, Lord Tarwick, it's your turn. Right. Lyman Lannister. Ten years ago, Lyman was injured at the tourney at Lannisport. He took a bad fall from his horse, needed milk of the poppy for weeks just to keep from screaming. Oh. And between us, he's never stopped drinking the stuff. Can't stop, actually. He spent all his money trying to get more. The man can't go a day without it. So that's why he shakes. Ah. You mustn't repeat that, Lady Mira. I shouldn't even know about it. Besides, Lyman suffered enough embarrassment. Then why did you tell me? Because of... Well, maybe I shouldn't have. I'd hate for Lord Andros to trace this back to me. Wird das schon nicht, wird das schon nicht. The man's mouth is bigger than the black water. Poor Lyman has no idea. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have some arrangements to make. Lady Mira. 